Hello, people of the internet. Welcome back to, uh, you know, this channel. This channel that does things sometimes, apparently. I wanted to make a super low-key video. I'm just gonna have Smash Tournament gameplay running in the background. I'm watching this as I talk. I just wanted to make a video about where, you know, I've been after literally advertising the channel as I'm gonna make videos every single week and then going four weeks without posting a video. So I've been having construction in front of my house and that construction has, for the third time now, cut the cut the wires that connect the internet to my house. So therefore I go without internet for an entire week. And when we live in the 21st century, that means you can do fuck all, literally nothing. So that stopped me from making uh, damn near anything pretty much, other than like drawings and some design work and ideas and writing on the side, but I wasn't able to actually make any videos. Not only that, but my computer has also had the problem where it can no longer keep up with exporting and rendering the videos or creating the animations, because sometimes I use After Effects and like in Partner, whatever you want to say, along with Premiere and that's just becoming too much for my laptop, so I'm looking into investing into a better build. But for the time being, the... I mean, what, like the whole time I've had the YouTube channel, I've had crashes in Premiere, but not to this extent where I'll do the slightest move of text on screen with a couple different assets and editing, and it just crashes my entire computer, reboot it, and then start from wherever my last save was. I mean, other than that, I've just taken some time and I've, like, I've, I've kind of evaluated what I wanted to do with the channel, and recently I've been making the first looks videos instead of just doing the gameplay, or not the gameplay, the game essays, and I wasn't, I wasn't too happy with the way that those videos were going because I was, I was trying to find another video format that I could put in there that would make it so I had a weekly upload so I'd have a video that would be shorter and took a lot less time to make. And then I would have my bigger gaming essays that ended up being like 10 to 12 minutes long with a bunch of editing. But that just, it just didn't work out. I ended up putting too much time into the first looks videos and I wasn't as passionate about writing so therefore I didn't have like, I didn't have that good of a script. Oh, look at that. Look at that smash. The double KO smash right at the end. Whoo! So, I... I don't know, I didn't like the quality of the videos that were then going on. Like, I didn't like the quality of the first looks. I, I feel like they were starting to lack. And I, even my gaming essays were starting to lack. And with the quick hit on the finale, on the sudden death... I don't normally play Dark Pit, but I should play way more Dark Pit. I shouldn't say that, I probably just got two really, really lucky hits. Other than that, I have been working on some other projects as well. Some of them I'm not willing to talk about at this point. Some of them I want to keep hidden. I don't know when I'm going to release those to the public. I don't know if I'm going to release those to the public, but I'm definitely going to keep those quiet for now. Very few people in like my real life and my personal life actually know what those projects are. Some of them are just, like, they only exist in my head right now, and there's stuff that I really, really want to try, and I feel like I could possibly excel at creatively, and they'll all tie into this channel. They'll all get posted on this channel. It's just, I'm not sure how I'm going to execute it, or there's stuff that, like, there are things that I have literally zero experience in, so it's going to be learning from the ground up. One of those things is... Well, here, I'll, I'll explain where this little YouTube situation came from. When I started making the YouTube videos, it is something that I've always, always, always wanted to do. I've always wanted to make YouTube videos. And I had a full-time job that I started to hate. And I've made videos about this before. I made vlogs about it before I even started doing gaming essays. And I have to yawn. So... I was at a job that I hated, loved in the beginning, hated it in the end, and I quit that job, and I was unemployed, 
I had a lot of money saved up because I was very careful with what I was doing, so I figured I could have a little runway, I could start my own business, and then I didn't end up liking that too much. And I found myself without a creative outlet because that, that full-time job that I had, fucking messenger going off in the background. That full-time job that I had was a design job and it left a really sour taste in my mouth. And that was my passion up until this point. That was what I did creatively. It was what I sought out to do anything uh, like experimental. I would draw, I would very, very rarely paint, but the majority of the time I was working in design. I, I hadn't even experimented with video editing before that. So, I jumped into the YouTube thing, and I found out that, like, man, I fucking love making YouTube videos. It is awesome. It is so much fun. I have complete creative freedom. I can do whatever I want with them, and I can be as weird as I want with them, and I feel like those could only really exist on YouTube. But then, I also put way, way, way too much... Uh, expectations into the growth of the YouTube channel and I thought a lot more success would come of it and I'm not saying that I'm not thankful for 167 subscribers because that shit means so much to me 167 people is still a ton of people if you think about it that is if I had 167 people standing in front of me that is an audience like that is a big crowd so I am actually willing to talk about one of these side projects and that is that I'm thinking about doing streaming. I did Let's Plays way before now. And I think I might want to get back into it, but not necessarily in the Let's Play format, more in the streaming format, so I could sit down and just, like, drive through four or five hours. Four or five hours sounds like a lot. Maybe two hours of playing a game and hanging out and talking. And that way I don't feel like I have to do a lot of editing or I don't have to, like, forcefully make comedic edits or stuff and then I'll probably I might upload those to YouTube afterwards. I'm not sure yet. Man, I forgot how I even like started this recording. I don't know if those streams are going to be on Mixer or Twitch or YouTube. I'm not sure yet. I'm I feel like I'm just going to have to experiment with it and then we'll see where that goes. Other than that, a lot of my time has been going to the Over and Out podcast. If you haven't checked that out, it's a podcast that I do that's centered on gaming news. And is it's just three friends of mine and I, and we're just, we sit down, we hash out some video game news, we have some laughs, and we get really, really fucking weird with it. That's pretty much the best way I can sum it up. We're on, uh, going on episode 10 now. That shit's crazy. Like, that shit's a lot of fun. We're putting, like, a bunch of effort into hoping that it hoping that it goes somewhere. We're just, mostly for right now, it's just having fun with it. But that's also taking up a lot of time because it takes the, the design work for it, the social work for it. Uh, I handle all the YouTube videos and the editing for that. And that has been killer on my computer as well. But that's one of my big, big projects that's going on right now, amongst all those other projects that I can't talk about or don't really want to talk about at this point in time. So, hey, now you're you're in the loop. You're in the know-how. I do wanna I do wanna point out that I am still going to be making YouTube videos just at a much slower rate. And I can, man, I can see how people get burned out from making YouTube videos every single week. I just died a little bit. It's a lot of work. Like, I was putting in maybe 30 hours a week into the videos and up on top of a part-time job and on top of doing client work for design on top of that part-time job. It was a lot. And I was beginning to stress about it way, way, way too much. And I wanted to, like... I wanted the YouTube videos to be a purely fun, creative journey instead of a very stressful, creative journey. So now I'm going to focus on just making videos that I'm really, really proud of. And then, hey, if those naturally get subscribers, then that's awesome. If they don't, then that's cool, too. I'm just going to make them for basically for my enjoyment at this point. And 
make sure that I like I can say that they're the best videos that I want to make. Can I make this dodge? Can I make this dodge? Avoid the stairs. No. Stairs? Why did I say stairs? I meant to say ledge. Avoid the side. Not the fucking stairs. So hey, now you know. And that's what's been going on with me. And I don't know why this would be the first video I was going to say. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe. But don't, don't do that because... Well, I mean, hey, if you're new and you're watching this video for some fucking reason, go ahead and do that. But if not, don't do that because you've probably already done it. And I'm making no sense right now. This is just a bunch of rambling. Because I don't know how to end videos when I don't have a script. Thank you so much for watching this video. I guess we'll go with that. And keep an eye out because I'm going to be making videos. And hint, hint, the next video is going to be about a certain game that I'm really excited for. Borderlands 3. And possibly one of its predecessors in relation to it. That's probably all I'm going to give away about it, though. Who knows? I might tease a little more on Instagram or something like that. You'll just have to see. Well, un until then, I'll still have the most awkward outros on all of YouTube. And thanks for sticking around. I'll catch you later. <laughs>